is sheet mask time again. So we're doing another Bio Bell one today, and this is the hashtag Stay Gorgeous one. It hydrates and nourishes, and it has almond oil and vitamin E in it. It's another one with botanic ten cell fiber, paraben free, gluten free, no GMOs. I bought this at Kohl's for like four bucks. Uh, I'm not sure if they're still selling them, but I bought them maybe like six months ago, so I imagine they still sell. So. Let's see here. BioBell's gently formulated serum infused with natural botanical extracts enhances hydration to reveal beautiful, younger looking skin. Vitamin E improves the skin's ability to fight off free radicals, helping to protect against environmental aggressors that can lead to the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, while almond oil softens and moisturizes, leaving your skin smooth and glowing. So, step one. Profit. No, I, <laughs> I fucked up that joke anyway. Um, start with clean, dry skin. Already did that. Although I should tuck my hair under a little more again. Eh, close enough. It's gonna come back out anyway. We all know it. <laughs> it does what it wants. Step two, remove the fiber mask from the package. Either side may be gently applied to the face, smooth with fingers so that it may adapt perfectly, fitting around evenly around the eyes, nose, and mouth. Leave on for 15-20 minutes. Peel away the mask and wipe off any excess liquid, then proceed to rinse and apply the moisturizer of your preference. So, now that we rinse off one, our ingredients are water, glycerin, propanediol, tocopherol, sodium adsorbable phosphate, sweet almond seed oil, PEG slash PPG 17 slash 6, copolymer, sodium acrylates copolymer, lecithin, trehalose, 1, 2, hexanediol, Alanfoin, dipotassium, glycerizate, hydroxyethyl cellulose, PEG-40, hydrogenated castor oil, phthalate-free fragrance, sodium hydroxide, hydroxyacetophenones, uh, sodium citrate, and phenoxyethanol. So, I do remember from the last one of these, they open from the bottom, not the top, so I've been trying to hold it kind of upside down this whole time, so the serum runs the other way. It's still- did you see that squirt? Did you see that squirt? This mask's a dirty girl. But anyway, so, let's go ahead. It has almost the same scent as the other one, what the hell? That's so weird, I totally thought, you know, the other one would- smell like roses and like oranges but then this one smells almost the same what the crap it's so drippy though like I tried to squeeze off some of the excess into there and it just is still soaked this is like oversaturated bio bell I appreciate what you're doing but uh this is a little teeny tiny bit overkill just saying we don't need quite this much especially when it's a rinse off one not one that you just leave on just saying but anyways. <laughs> Which side is it folded on? Where is the edge? There it is. Where is the edge with Bono? But um anyway. This one really, really wants to just slide into my fucking mouth because it's so wet. And I'm like, damn it, stop that. Stop that, you. God, there's so much of this. I'm gonna be constantly holding it like this the whole time, aren't I, just to keep it out of my damn mouth. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm gonna go ahead and start that timer and we'll report back after. Okay, so took it off and I want to say I think it worked. Um, it doesn't seem like it gave an artificial glow. I think it gave a very natural one actually, uh, even though it didn't really purport glow benefits. Uh, it was fun for hydration really, which definitely did and boy did my skin need it. Now, I'm hoping that it'll do better than the last one I used from BioBell because that one, while initially it felt amazing afterwards, by the next day, it kind of sparred some, or sparked some really bad cystic acne along my jawline right here. So I'm hoping we don't have a round two of that. I don't know what was up with that one. That's kind of the gamble you take when you have breakout prone skin and you go 
bouncing from skincare product to skincare product. It happens sometimes. It comes with the territory. But hopefully, fingers crossed, this one will do better. Um, but my skin does feel super duper smooth and soft and hydrated, which was exactly the goal. So I'm pretty happy with it. I'd say it's worth your four bucks. And for how much excess serums in there, I totally say refold that mask, shove it back in the sachet, stick it in your fridge, reuse it in the next day or two, you're good to go. You can get another use or two out of it. So, anyways, that's it for this one, guys. So, as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload, leave comments down below, make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more, it's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel, you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time.